Morning you guys, how's it going? I'm out uh, with Keegan here today and uh, Keegan just drove out from Saskatchewan. You and your buddy Ben, um, you guys drove out together. Uh, how were the roads? Pretty, uh, pretty They were good, good yeah. yeah no, they were good. awesome. That's awesome. Um, they drove all the way out just to do an introductory flight here with us. We got an amazing day for it. Looking forward to getting out on it. This is your first time ever in a helicopter, right? First time ever, yeah. yeah. Oh, <laughs> we'll see how it goes. It should be awesome. Let's get going. All right, so Keegan's about one minute on the controls now, and my hand is not on the control at the moment. And this is pretty good. You're <laughs> kind of holding it straight and level. Keep your eyes out. Going to be looking at the horizon there, looking at that hill in front of you. And uh, you're doing a great job at keeping the helicopter pretty darn steady right now. That's really good. Why don't we try just a little bit of a right turn? So just a, a tiny bit of pull to the right. That's looking good. Nice turn there. And then let's level that out. So back to the left a little bit. That's all cyclic. There you go. Nice. And you see how the nose is diving a little bit? We're kind of heading there. Just pull up ever so slightly. <laughs> <laughs> and then a little bit to the left there. You got it. Nice work. So we're still kind of heading at the ground a little bit. I'll uh, bring the power up just a touch. Pushing forward a little bit, pushing forward, pushing forward. I think part of the problem was our power was dropping as well. There you go. Power is back up again. So push that nose forward a little bit. You got it. Level it out. Nice work. That's good. Keep pushing forward a little bit more. A little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. There you go. Right there. Hold that. That's a nice attitude. A little bit more. You're getting there, you're getting there. <laughs> How's it feeling? Pretty good. Pretty insane, isn't yeah, it? You're no, flying a helicopter, buddy. Pretty sweet. <laughs> That's so cool. A right. little sketchy, but yeah. not too bad. Yeah, it'll become less sketchy the longer you do it, right? Um, you get more and more comfortable at it. That's good. Keep pushing a little more forward just to get that attitude. There you go, right there. That's nice. And let's try that left turn again. So pulling uh, that control or pushing, I guess, to the left a little bit. The other left. <laughs> you got it. Push forward a little bit and then over a little bit to the left. There you go. A little bit more, a little bit more. Mission traffic helicopter cabbage G2, Golf Uniform Echo Tango is 1400 feet just over the western side of Mission. We're going to be heading northbound. So this is a pretty common type confined area that we would go to. Um, and you can see it's pretty tight, right? Um, not a ton of room for the trees all around us. But um, yeah, typical helipad. They would just come up here to service a tower like that. Pretty neat, eh? Yeah, no, that's cool. All right. A little bit of a harder one, probably, eh? Yeah, exactly. You know, the the tighter it is, the only thing that would make this harder is if the trees were a lot taller, um, and then you were really limited on power. But um, it was nice. There was a bit of wind coming over the edge there today. We were getting a little bit of twitching. You probably felt that on the way in. But uh, that's good. Let's go ahead and lift off and get out of here. Nice work. All right. So we're just coming by Stave Lake here now, and we're descending down, so we've got our power down a little bit. Working our way down to Sayers Lake, which is just out over here. We're gonna go do a landing there. What do you think? Is this uh, tighter spots than you're expecting to go into today? For sure, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a nice little helipad here, right on the edge of the lake. Nice. Gonna say hi to your family back home. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. All right, so we're just heading back to the airport now. We're gonna go just a little more to the left there. And um, we are gonna try some hover work. So um, it's looking nice in the infield. There's a little foggy out in Glen Valley. Tango, continue. Oh, here we are. Cross overhead midfield, not below 800 feet. There's gonna be multiple departures. And a landing field at Pod's discretion. Okay, cleared over midfield, not below 800 feet for Uniform Echo Tango. Awesome. All right, so um, we're just going to keep going straight ahead. We got to cross the tower. That works perfect because we want to do an auto rotation there as well. And then we'll work our way in. And just checking our windsock. The winds are pretty much out of the north. The helicopter down there. 
Three Papa Romeo, number two, follow Cessna two mile final. Number two, three Papa Romeo. Okay. So we're going to enter the auto rotation in three, two, one, in we go. So throttle's coming off. Got a nice descent rate going here. Going to get a turn into wind. And this is looking good. We want to go to about 50 knots, so we're going to slow down just slightly. Charlie Hotel, Charlie, contact outer tower, one, two, one, zero. And as you can see here, the rotor and motor are split, so the motor's not actually doing anything for us right now. And at the bottom, we're going to do this nice big flare. Contact outer tower, one, two, one, zero. That slows everything down. And then we just cushion the landing. Nice. This would be exactly what it would feel like, except we would touch the ground. If it was a full down auto. Pretty cool, eh? Yeah, no, that's sweet. <laughs> right on. Um, okay, so we want to try a little bit of hover work. Um, I'm going to move over here just slightly. And we'll get our back towards the sun a little bit so we're not fighting that sun on our face. And then we're going to try each control individually. We're going to start with the pedal. So why don't you put your hands in your lap? And we're going to start with working those pedals. So um, as you can see, we have a fair bit of right pedal right now. You just need to keep that amount of right pedal in there. Keep your, no, your eyes up for looking at that yellow airplane in front of us there. And I'm going to take my feet off, push a little more right pedal. There you go, you got it, you got it. That's looking good. Charlie Fox Shot Sierra, contact outer tower, 1210. Very nice. So my feet are on the floor now. That doesn't feel so bad, right? No, not too bad at all. Still a bit of a right pedal turn. We'll go 90 degrees to the right. Michael Fox Shot, contact outer tower, 1210. That's looking good. We'll stop there. I'll slowly come back to the left again, face that yellow airplane. That's looking good. Yeah, you have really good control of those pedals. And then we can come to the left 90 degrees. Nice and slow. See how that one really wants to spin you around? Oh right? yeah. That's the direction of torque. So torque is trying to spin you in that direction. And so really, you're just holding it back from spinning. So when you go left, you're not actually really pushing left pedal. Let's go ahead and push that right pedal again. Yep. <laughs> More right pedal, there you go, you got it. There we go. You're not actually technically pushing left pedal, you're just easing off that right foot yeah. is actually what you're doing for those left pedal turns. That's kind of interesting. That's definitely a lot quicker when it's going that way. It's amazing, right? Yeah, so that's a torque turn. And then when you go to the right, we call that a power pedal turn. Feel the power Okay. I'll try another left here. Yep, sounds good. Yeah. Nice. Okay, let's keep it pointed at the yellow airplane now. And then I'm going to get you to do the collective. So I've got the pedals. So you can do just the left hand. The right hand you can keep in your lap for now. That's good. Feet can go on the floor. Excellent. And so left hand. So what we're trying to do with this one is just keep the helicopter in one spot. Don't let it go up or down. Just keep it hanging out in that one spot there. Trying to get up negative view number three. How do you read? Okay, let's go ahead and go up 10 feet. Roger, please use your ident as well. That's nice, so we'll hold there. Thank you. Charlie Yankee Golf, turn base. Charlie Yankee Golf, turn base. And let's come down back to that height that we were at before, about three feet off the ground. Nice. You're great at that, that's good. Papa Bravo Charlie, number three, follow Cessna, 12 o'clock, right base. Okay. Why don't we get you to add the pedals into that? So just go ahead and uh, put your feet on the pedals again as well. 
And remembering we need lots of right pedal, I'm going to give you both controls. So now you have the pedals, lots of right pedal, there you go. And you have the collective as well. And you're keeping your eyes up, looking at the yellow airplane will be nice. Keep that right pedal in there, you got it. Turn into the downwind to the top room. In a down like your fall shot, sending it on the under the eye look for zero at two thousand. Michael Foxshot, descend to your discretion, continue right base. Sending right base, Michael Foxshot. Yeah, let's try and bring it down again. Charlie and Gig Golf, clear touch and go runway zero one. Charlie and Gig Golf, touch and go. Abbotsford Tower, Zulu Charlie Hotel, requesting an infield circuit. To the pop Romeo, turn left, go northbound. Turn left, just go runway heading northbound. Left, uh, northbound to the pop Romeo. There you go, that's looking nice. Tower, uh, Charlie, uh, Charlie, traffic in front of us. Uh, do you want us turning right? Charlie, uh, Lima, Charlie, just Very good. That, that, I have uh, both circuit. controls, so Charlie, you can go ahead and put your feet on the floor, Charlie, left, left hand in your lap, circuit, turn left and then you're going to use your right hand now. Left this is the tricky one, and we're going to try and keep the helicopter nice and steady in one spot. So keep looking at the yellow airplane there, and just do your absolute best with that control. You have control now to keep the helicopter in one spot. Keep working at it. Victor Hotel, off and field circuit approved. Wind 020 at 7, take off and land to discretion. Yeah, nice job, nice job. Pop Romeo, turn down one Keep the eyes up, keep looking at that yellow airplane. And Julia Pop Romeo, uh, I think I know what you were trying to do there. That that was that was strange though. Don't do that next time. If you go left, just go left, fly a normal circuit, please. <laughs> That was funny. To the pop Romeo, extend down when I'll call your base turn. This is incredible, dude. You're doing really good. Keep the base turn close. Be able to hover like this on your first time without any directions or anything? That's really, really good. Oh, now I'm giving you too much praise. <laughs> yeah, keep your eyes up. All right, let me reposition you. I have control. I'm gonna reposition you over here. How are you temperature-wise? Are you getting hot or are you? Yeah, a little bit, but I'm all right. Okay, should be good. We can. Uh, we can just pop my door, put it on the string. Zulu Charlie Hotel. Zulu Charlie Hotel. Zulu Charlie Hotel requesting an infield circuit. Zulu Charlie Hotel. Follow the uh, Bell 47, 12 o'clock infield circuit approved. Wind 0406. Take off and land at discretion. That's going to cool it down a little bit. All right, so I'm going to come back up again, get it nice and steady, and I'm going to give it over to you again. So you have control of the cyclic there. The highway before turning crosswind. Charlie, Pop, Quebec, your traffic is one mile final runway zero one. Traffic is at zero Pop, Quebec. Guys, keep those eyes up, stay nice and relaxed, small movements. Beauty, usually people can lose control pretty quick with this one. And you're managing to be able to keep it under control, so that's good. Deadly. Keep your eyes up. Every time you look down, you kind of start to lose reference. So the more you keep your eyes up, the better it's going to be. Foxshot clear to land on way zero one. Mike Golf Foxshot. That's awesome. Charlie Yankee Golf turn right crossroads. Charlie Yankee Golf turn right. Pop up Bravo Charlie, follow the Seth Metro at 11 o'clock. They are in the circuit. Pop up Bravo Charlie. Quebec, all red base. Quebec, number one. Zero, Quebec, 
another one. Michael Fox, right exit Bravo, contact ground 128 one Exiting Michael Fox, clear to land runway 01. Zero one. Zero one. Do the Papa Romeo turn final. Incredible, dude. Turn final to the Papa Romeo. Really, really impressive. Right, Yankee Golf, your number four, following a test on left base, runway 01. Now the Yankee Golf, number four. So just for fun, I'm going to give you the collective as well. Okay, so just try and keep it nice and steady there. Try and keep it in one height. So you have the collective and the cyclic. Now this will probably be too much, but that's okay. That's good. Not bad. Keep bringing her down real gently. We want to come back down a little lower again. <laughs> Power, you guys are not pulling towards zero seven and delta. You guys are not line up on my zero seven. I'm a little squirrely. Yeah, I, get, uh, I have control. We can fly together for a second. Okay. We're just going to reposition back over here so you have a little more space again. But that's pretty good, man. I mean, yeah. it's not smooth and perfect, but uh, you're not losing control with the two two controls, which is usually pretty overwhelming. So. Okay, we're going to steady out here. Papa Bravo, Charlie, number four, follow assessment at 12 o'clock, two months. Okay, let's start with the cyclic again, so you can get it steadied out a little bit there. Departure not above. You have control. From Delta, clear for takeoff from A07. Departure not above 145, And then you can add the collective into that, so you have control of the collective as well. And you can just acknowledge by saying, I have control. I have control. There you go. <laughs> sort of. <laughs> sort of. <laughs> Good, you got her. Keep her going. Down again. Nice and gentle. Nice, let's bring it back into a controlled hover. I have control. That's beauty. I'm just going to give you the cyclic again. So we're left handed in the lap again. We're going to do one more shot of uh, just cyclic here. So eyes are out, looking at the yellow airplane. You have control. You can say, I have control. I have control. There you go. Nice work. Papa Bro, Charlie, clear touch and go runway 0 1. Papa Bravo Charlie for a full stop. Papa Bravo Charlie, clear to land on way 01. We're going to land Papa Bravo Charlie. Jill Papa Romeo, turn B. And there we are. <laughs> Charlie Lima, Charlie number 3, follow test the 12. Right call. on. Nice work. So we're just going to give the heli a, a cool down. So we're going to shut the governor off. Idle it down. Congrats, man. You did really right good. <laughs> that was fun. That was really fun. Oh, that was fun, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed that little uh, little video. Did a good job. Came a long ways. You conquered. <laughs> nice <to> work. <laughs> Maybe we'll see you back in a uh, little bit. Yeah, who knows? Actually might doing be this for a little. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool, man. Awesome. Hope you guys enjoyed this. We'll talk to you in the next one. See ya.